This is question 15. College Board is asking us to rewrite an expression using rational exponents using a radical instead. And when I do these, I like to separate the constant from the variable. So using my exponent rules, this is negative 4 to the 2 thirds times x cubed to the 2 thirds. And with, a, with the constant, I'm going to square it first. So this is negative 4 squared, and that expression to the 1 third. Negative 4 times negative 4 is positive 16. So that's 16 to the 1 third, which is cube root of 16 is cube root of 8 times 2, which is cube root 8 times cube root 2. And cube root 8 is 2, so it's 2 cube root 2 is our constant, which is either A or C. It's not D, and it's not B. And we know it's not A because A has a negative, and we just square the negative to get a positive. So the correct answer is C. I didn't have to look at the variable. But let's look at the variable. X squared to the 2 thirds, with a power of a power, you multiply exponents. So that would be x to the 3 times 2 thirds, which is x squared. And that is an exact match for choice C. College Board typically asks you to rewrite a radical with rational exponents or rewrite an expression with rational exponents, but use a radical. So make sure you can go both ways on this question and come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.